What's up, crazy YouTubers? It's Mike from the Autograph Network. A.K. The Godfather. Come from the home office with a TTM. Three for... Got three TTMs today uh, and some awesomeness for autographs for Rick here. Um, always love getting stuff in, but when something extra comes for autographs for Rick here, uh, it's pretty awesome. So let's just jump right into this. First one coming from LA, Los Angeles, California. Playboy Playmate from 1967 in April. Gwen Wong, she was one of the first uh, like Asian American playmates. Uh, here is a cool Playboy Club magazine. Big back in the day. There with the 467 inscription. April was her cover date. Oh, very cool. Uh, next one coming from overseas. Sorry, I was just looking at the stamps. Uh, this is pretty cool return for me because... Uh, I love this show. Uh, Joanne Lumley, you guys might not recognize her from that photo. She's a former model and actress. You guys might not recognize her from that photo. But if you're a little older, you will recognize her from this photo. Uh, if you guys have ever seen Ab Fab, it was a British comedy. Hilarious. Uh, she played Patsy. And here's a second one. So those all turned out great. So that's pretty cool. Um, again, funny show if you've never seen it, but uh, it's slightly older. But next one, not my SASE. So you know what that usually means when it's something big like that. That means 8 by 10 uh, Like I said, something awesome for autographs for Akira came in. I would have been happy with my photos spanked, which he did. Um, and he is one of the top NHL stars right now, not for my Tampa Bay Lightning, uh, Mr. John Tavares, now playing for the Toronto Maple Leafs, number 91 inscription, again, like I said, he spanked him, very cool action shot there, love the back of the jersey shots, looks awesome. Here he is, the goal shot. Like I said, I would have been ecstatic with those um, just to get those back. I uh, would have kept one or two and at least one would have gone for autographs right here. But now I got something else. Boom, big eight by 10. Same photo I sent, but in the eight by 10 version. And again, spanked. John Tavares uh, included some nice cardboard to keep the, the uh, photo safe. So uh, to see one of the top stars in any sport signing autographs is awesome. And I know I'm not the first person to get him. Um, he's actually pretty fan friendly. Uh, so that's, that's so awesome to see. Um, I know not every top player is like that. I'm um, not saying he's the best in the NHL, but he is one of, one of the good guys. So um, pretty awesome to see. So that will definitely be going up for uh, autograph strike here, something from John Tavares. So that is pretty awesome. Uh, good mail day. Nice way to start off the week. Um, I did order the next batch of photos from Amazon. Um, I got mostly 4 by 6s <clears throat> I got an 8x10 and some 5x7. Uh, I'm actually going to be doing some map pieces. Uh, we got some stuff that I don't collect, like uh, books. Sorry, Zane Savage. Um, I don't collect signed books. They don't display well. They take up a lot of room. And uh, I've got a Tim Tebow book that I'm going to mat with an 8x10 and possibly put up for autographs for a cure. Um, but instead of just doing a cut auto, I'm going to, I got a mat cutter and I'm going to try my hand at some mat cutting. So maybe I'll show you guys some of that process or the end product to see what you guys think. But, um, so I've got my address labels. 
Uh, I got to do that, get those ready because Amazon ships quickly with Prime. So I should have my photos by the end of the week, I think. So anyways, rambling. Good to see Mr. Stacy Schaefer. The autograph dude was back on YouTube. Even those videos kind of glitchy. Go check him out. Uh, no show this week for Autographers Anonymous. We will be on next week, our bi-weekly show. So every other week. Uh, that's it. Anyways, Mike from the Autograph Network.